understand is that this information that you guys have here is literally for free. There's so much value here. And all you guys have to do is share this. And now we have one of the top income earners in the world all because he shared what you guys just saw. So that being said, I want you guys to get crazy because you have right here, five feet away, Mr. Matt. intimidated me heavily the charts the graphs the lines the numbers the colors I wasn't sure that I would be able to do something like that I was extremely extremely interested I was extremely passionate about the ideology of going out there and learning a skill set like trading but man whoever said this is a get rich quick you were in the wrong room <laughs> Trading is literally one of the hardest things that I've ever learned in my entire life. It's one of the most difficult things. It's one of the most challenging things. And as I began to learn how to trade, I fell in love with two things. The first thing that I fell in love with was the ability to be able to control my own income. The second was the mental fortitude that it created for me. Everyone here knows if you've traded inside of the markets on a live account, it's one of the most humbling experiences that you're ever going to have. Oh, yes. I remember the first time I saw blue on my Mediterranean 4, I fell in love. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> I think it was like $2.50, but I was like, man. <laughs> it turned up in a really big way. And then the first loss. Oh my God. And then the first blown account. And then the second blown account. And I started to realize something. Outside of this company, if you're leverage trading, you're usually by yourself. It's a solo sport. And I appreciated that, but I understand that commitment lasts longer in community. Commitment lasts longer in community. So, fast forward about two years, I'm having a conversation with Ivan Paycheck. And he starts to talk to me about the power of cryptocurrency. And just like everyone else, I said no to cryptocurrency so many times inside of my life. I said no to it back in 2012 when I first found out about it. I said no to cryptocurrency again in 2015. It wasn't until 2016 that I was finally able to bring Ivan into the community that we have here, into our family, in order to launch DCX. 2016 hits, we're, all, we're traveling literally all around the world. We're teaching people crypto. We're teaching people at the time I didn't own any type of crypto. None at all. And I'm watching him. And I'm seeing the, 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 the price article be released on him. I'm seeing all these different entrepreneurs endorsing cryptocurrency. I'm, I'm, I'm watching the trend. And I said, man, I got to find myself a way into this. We must have been on a 30-day tour. And every night, I even paid him, where's the best out of my Bitcoin? Now! Is this is the Now! <laughs> <laughs> we, were, we were at the event actually out in Las Vegas. And he said, when's the next time, best time to buy Bitcoin? Everybody's always wondering, when's Bitcoin getting to 100K? Why is Bitcoin low right now? Everyone always is a critic on the sideline talking about cryptocurrency. You know who's not critics? The ones that own it. Woo. The people that own the cryptocurrency. So we said, when's the next time to buy Bitcoin? Right now. I pulled out my phone and I bought Bitcoin. My first entry into Bitcoin was $4,000. I began to dollar cost average DCA into cryptocurrency over the last few years. I'm gonna tell you this, cryptocurrency is my best, and I have a lot of investments. 
I'm into real estate. I'm, I, I'm into a bunch of different things. Cryptocurrency is by far the best producing and most exciting investment that I have. And I'm gonna explain why. You see, for me, cryptocurrency, what I fell in love with cryptocurrency was the aspect of community. I can't get in the group chat and talk about USD. <laughs> I'm not in the group chat talking about JPY. I'm not in the group chat talking about the Swiss franc. But I'm in group chat right now talking about my favorite projects. I'm getting updates on my favorite NFT projects directly from the CEOs. I'm able to gauge the amount of participation that people have in my favorite projects based off of the involvement that they have on their social platforms. You see, what I see cryptocurrency as is the currency of the people. We're taking the power back. Let's go. We're taking the power back. I no longer have to re re result and, 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 and rely on the economical situation of certain countries. No, 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 no. Supply and demand, baby. Woo! Yes. Fuck the government! <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> so here's what I encourage you guys. By no means am I a crypto expert, because I'm not. This is honest to God, I'm not a crypto, a crypto expert. And I gotta give a massive shout out to these two gentlemen right here. Mike Sotero and Curtis Woo! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! They put me onto projects that I would have never heard of. Projects that have done amazing, amazing things. Not just from a return aspect. I'm not just talking about going ahead and making money off of these projects, but they're solving problems. You want to find a way to become wealthy inside of this world? Find a way to be able to solve people's problems. If you can be a problem solver, you'll always find yourself resourceful for your community. I'm not the best speaker, I'm not the best presenter, I'm not the best enroller, but I'll be damned if I can't find a solution for my people. That's what cryptocurrency does. I started becoming a student, that's all I am. All I am is a student. I'm not an educator for this platform. I, 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 I simply saw the opportunity to solve a problem for our company through cryptocurrency education. And I've been a student to each and every single one of these individuals. I'm looking at them, they look like the Avengers. I'm like Panther, man. But I'm simply a student to these people. Ask them, I'll jump on the phone with Kurt, I'll jump on the... These two are my mentors when it comes to cryptocurrency. I jump on the phone with them and I'm a nerd. I just fall in love with the research that they're doing and they teach me and they put me on game. They're doing the same thing for each and every single one of you guys. If I'm deciding, people, people are saying, man, what are we gonna do at the bottom of crypto right now? What are we gonna do? Buy more. <laughs> no brainer. The other, day, the other day I was on the flight headed to New York and I'm sitting next to this really wealthy individual. And he asked me, what do you do? And I started telling him a little bit about what we do. And he said, oh, you're involved in crypto? I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> he said, what do you think about it right now? I said, it's on sale, dude. What are you talking about? <laughs> Pick up your, your favorite project for low right now, man. Because of these individuals, me being a student, that's all I am. I follow instructions. That's all I do. I follow instructions. I go do my own research and I invest, man. And I'm a product of the product. Woo. Raise your hand if you've seen me on tour before in your city. Yes. yes. Woo. You've seen me on tour. Have I been to your country before? Yes. <laughs> um, if you see me in the city, I guarantee it's with the DTX. If you see me in the city, 
You've seen me in your city before, whether I've been to over 45 countries to build this business. I would say 40 of them with my DTS family. And there's a reason as to why. I trust them. I believe in them. I'm a product of the product. I'm a student myself. So I know this next bull run, I saw what happened to my business last time. The last bull run, my business quadrupled in size. And during the bull runs, everyone's a crypto expert. Yes. <laughs> it's not about being a crypto expert, it's about positioning your people so that they can see the same experiences that so many of us have seen inside of the crypto market. We're not here pushing any one project. We're not here pushing any one NFT. We're here to position people. Yes. So yes. that in the next three years, yes. they're thanking these guys. Yes. Woo! This, you want to go chairman, this is the product to push. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yes. You want to go up and you want to hit chairman 25, this is the product to push. Yes. Why? Because at the end of the day, this is something that people can get behind. This is something people can get behind. It's not just about making profits, man. It's about building a community where we solve each other's problems. It's about building a community that you can lean on one another. That's what DCX represents. DCX represents building a community, building a family that is moving in unison towards one specific task and one specific goal. And I know for a fact, this next bull run, they're gonna have to create three new ranks for the comp plan because I'm bursting through all of them using this. <laughs> So guys, thank you so much. Peace yeah. family. I love you guys. Yeah. Yeah. DCX, 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 DCX. Check it out, check it out, check it out. We all know that there's a lot of stuff in crypto. Yes or yes? Yes! I want you guys to get the real meat and potatoes because we're in a parking lot right now. <laughs> this is the real shit. <coughs> I'm go we're going to give two minutes to each of our educators to give you guys the secrets, the nuggets, the wisdom, the things that we cannot talk about on stage. Ooh. Ooh.